just excited to uh, you know get a get a win over I think a very quality opponent and SEC um, team in Auburn. So it's just been nice. It's, I just feel like the girls are really excited and they're playing really good basketball right now. Now that we don't have our moments, but um, but it's been a really good start to the season. With, uh, I think it was like 16:09 left. Montgomery hit a three at that point. She had 22 points. She ended just with 24. Mm -hmm. um, pretty pleased with down the stretch the way you guarded did you change anything and yeah we played a lot of man specifically for her I think we probably would have been a little bit more zone but she got free early and uh, she was really feeling it so faith guarded her for majority of that second half I thought she did a really good job on her yeah Faith, what was what kind of change I guess defensive because she was so uh -huh. automatic it seemed like yeah. early on well, um, I just had to make sure that I wasn't helping off too much on her because she has a quick release. So um, I just kind of, you know, locked up more on her towards the end of the game. Overall, your best defensive effort of the year to this point? It was good. Yeah, I thought we showed some really good glimpses. I thought as this one over here, SI, was just – I mean, really, we came in the game plan is that 44 wasn't going to – go off on us and I thought not only did her and Lauren do a really good job I thought the team we had a little bit of trapping going a little bit of digging on her and stuff um, but I thought they executed the game plan really well defensively yes yeah, Sarah can you talk about that matchup with with Tanner and uh, she think she come in averaging about 22, 22. Game. yeah I mean the game plan I mean going into the game coach told me how aggressive she is and how she's the leading scorer I did look for her every play and I just felt like we went into practice um, with the game plan could be brought up. I thought that was, it was amazing. I mean, I knew the help side was going to be there. So when I was playing today, I didn't, I didn't even have no worries because I know someone is there to help me out. So I, I was just playing. I mean, my goal was to limit her to 10, 10 point. And I felt like the team as a whole, we did a pretty good job with that. I thought Sarah did. I mean, a, a lot of that was Sarah just doing her work early. I mean, she didn't get any easy touches. I thought as I was really dialed in, um, it was definitely by far her best defensive performance um, for us because I thought she did a great job of doing her work early and carrying over the, the attention to detail things we were talking about today in shoot around. How much confidence are you playing with right now? I mean, these first four games, I mean, you've been pretty automatic. <laughs> I mean, I'm just playing. I'm just, I mean, I'm, I'm just having fun. I mean, I just love playing. With my sisters out there, I mean, I'm not scared. I know we've worked so hard during the summer, and I know we deserve what we're getting now. So we, I just feel like we're the team as a whole. We're just we're just confident in ourselves and in our coaches. So. Faith, can you kind of see that in the way SI is playing right now? And how much is that? Yeah, just so big for you right now. I mean, she's a bully on the boards. Um, you know, a lot of the opposing teams kind of just get out her way when, <laughs> you know, she's getting for rebounds. And, you know, we love it. Uh, she, she posts up hard, and we give her the ball, and she's she's finishing it. I mean, you look at their – I mean, she, yeah. yeah, Montgomery had 24, but nobody else had more yeah. than six. Yeah. You guys obviously were more balanced. Um, mm -hmm. Big difference in that game? Yeah, you know, we've been – I think we're three or four games in having three and four people in double figures, and that's – that's your goal as a coach is to get that kind of scoring and share the basketball. We're just so much harder to guard and defend and scout if we have multiple people that can step up and score for us. And I thought um, I, I love that about our team right now, that there's a lot of that going on. And um, always, room, always room for improvement on the defensive end of the floor. But, you know, it was a good game for us. A little erratic at times against mm -hmm. the press. Last couple minutes of the game. Yeah. I mean – can we just we'll write that one off? But, um, yeah, we had our moments throughout the game, but we, it, they wouldn't last long. Obviously, the last two or three minutes was a stretch there. But throughout the game, when it, was, when it really mattered, I just felt we got on track pretty quick after we you know, had one or two turnovers. First four games, um, you know, two wins over Ohio State and, and Auburn a road. Yeah. Win. I mean, could you have scripted a better start to this year to this point? No, four knows about as good as we could do. <laughs> 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 what do you like about this? The way you've you've got about it, the way you're the togetherness, the unity, um, laying just a great foundation, just all about team, all buy-in. Uh, nobody's looking for the glory. Um, the work ethic and practice, the attention to detail that we talk about, the camaraderie, um, the extra effort. You know, the ability and the confidence to want to win and know you're going to win the last three minutes of a game. Um, prior to tonight, you know, I mean, I just just a confidence about them. Okay. Everybody do, knows their role, you know. What do you, what do you is this? What's different about this team than the two previous teams you played on? 
Um, well, I think we're really um, taking initiative of defending more um, and just, you know, making an extra pass and um, getting each other open, better screens. Um, I think we're really understanding, you know, the offense and, you know, how important it is to get stops on defense. Yeah, you have to tell Bree to be more aggressive at times. We like do. One shot at halftime. <laughs> we do. Yes, we have to tell her. We tell her all the time um, because when you get what you get, I mean, why hold that back? So, you know, Bree knows we want her. We want her to be more vocal. And we want her to be more aggressive. So you, when you see Bree like that, we just let her go. Yeah. Because it seems like every time she drives, she's really she's so physical. Mm -hmm. She's physical. It's hard to stop her. You can't get. You can't knock her off the ball. And, uh, and she can finish well. She's a good free throw shooter. Um, but when she sees the lane, she knows how to ride a person in, you know, for the shot. So, yeah, it's been fun to watch her. It was fun to watch her tonight. This, and you had the ups and downs with the pack line at this point. Best you've seen it. Experts. You know, we're, I'm going to be honest, we're a little bit of a morphed version of the pack. You know, we're not, we're not obviously completely there because we got, we get beat off the dribble, you know, and we have to, that's not, uh, Obviously, that's the first thing you have to do on the pack line. So, you know, we, we've been morphing it a little bit here and there, but um, we just got to keep drilling, drilling, drilling to get better and better at it. Yeah.